We interrupt this program with some breaking news. With new jokes, new sets, and new surprises, season two of Mad is starting off with a bang. Oh, well, so much for starting off with a bang. My girlfriend's been kidnapped, and I'm the only bird in Rio that can't fly. Whee! Make that the only thing in Rio that can't fly. <gasps> a shooting star. I wish I could fly. Wait, that's not a shooting star. <laughs> Couldn't land closer, huh? The ring has chosen you, Hal Jordan. It will allow you to fly. Fly? That's awesome! I always wanted to fly! <laughs> Get in line, buddy. I need this more than you. Welcome to Oa, Hal Jordan of... Whoa! I think Hal is eaten by a chicken. I'm a macaw. Something's wrong. The ring would never choose a bird. Uh, hello, I resent that. Uh, but seriously, are you gonna eat that cracker? The ring is reserved for important matters. Flying is important, especially to birds who can't do it. So seek them out. <gasps> hey, a ring! Oh, but I'm the green one! A green lantern ring? Oh, I know where we're headed. Oh, uh. Oh, I guess they can only carry one at a time. Oh, wait. Meep, meep. Everyone, I've summoned you here to create a new green lantern core. Uh, I'm sorry, it's core. Green lantern core. The point being, the love of my life is being held against her will, so I need you all to take the oath. In brightest day, in blackest night, despite our shape, our size, our height, we're birds who walk, which isn't right. But starting now, we will take flight. Yep. She'll be coming back for me any time now. Gonna get a pretty penny for you, princess. Step away from her, Nigel, or else... Or else what? Show them what you can do, Mumble. I meant the ring. Oh, the ring! Right, right, right. <laughs> Not so fast, Birdie. <laughs> Nigel, what is the... <gasps> Green lanterns? Ha! Ah, luckily, your rings don't work on yellow. <laughs> You did it, Blue. You saved me and learned to fly. That ring can do anything. You're not kidding. How else do you think a movie like Rio made so much money? <laughs> Sir Harry Perkins, this court hereby sentences you to dance! <laughs> oh, wait. Sorry, it says death. My mistake. Off with his head! Ah! It just isn't fair. I'm never gonna get out of here. Is there anything I can do, sir? Not unless you can alter time, speed up the harvest, or teleport me off this rock. Jedi I got a guy. Needs to get to Alderaan quick. 10,000. All in advance. How about 2,000 now, plus 15 when we get to Alderaan? 17, huh? You got yourself a ship. Wait, but I could buy my own ship for that. Yeah, Simon? Theodore? Yeah. Well, the big fight is tonight, Angelo. Think he's ready? He's been at it six hours today, boss! Break time, Rocky! Thanks, Angelo! Well, champ, how do you feel? Great, boss! Long ago, the Chinese needed to defend themselves, so they built a wall. When that didn't work, they built a great wall. 
And when that didn't work, they added a hole in the Great Wall! <laughs> oh, looks like the Huns didn't make it. Let's see if the Mongolians fare any better. Three, two, one. Water's pretty cold, huh? My friend was eaten by an alligator. Let me ask you, would you try to attack China again? Not if I had to wear this crazy outfit, I wouldn't. Seriously, he was just eaten by alligator. I'd say alligators were the least of their problems. This guy can't get his arms up, and Fatty here looks like he should join a dance class. <laughs> so next time you're thinking of invading China, remember, they don't only have a great wall, they've got a whole in the Great Wall! It's like I don't even know you anymore. A good night's sleep can be impossible. What is this, a brick? That's why there's the new Sleepy Cloud, the comfiest pillow on the market. Ah. Just rest your head on its silky surface and you'll be counting sheep in no time. Thanks. Because each of our pillows has a 10,000 thread count. Fantastic. Plus ostrich feathers. Ostrich, well, that's, uh, that's something. From Africa. Okay, gonna go to sleep now. And what a sleep it'll be, because the contours of the pillow actually mold to your head. Sleeping. Granting you hours of solid slumber. I'm sorry, I should have mentioned, I, I have a meeting in the morning. Plus, doctors agree, a good night's sleep makes for a great day. That's my point, I'm trying the to sleep. The sleepy cloud lets dream-inducing elements in. Hello, are you deaf? While blocking out any outside noises. Great. All for only 30 $39.95. Which you can pay for in installments. Okay, that does it. Plus, the Sleepy Cloud is environmentally friendly, made from air and air like materials. So get rid of those puffy eyes once and for all with the. Hey, what are you doing here? I'll you can't show be you. Here. You're this is the union Sleepy gig. Cloud. Wait, I'm gonna read the text. Oh, 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 I'll give you oh, puffy eyes. Know you. Oh, 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 Did you bring home milk? Oh. It was a lovely day on the Isle of Sodor. The air was crisp, and there wasn't a cloud in the sky. Thomas, I've given you a much-needed tune-up, my friend, said Sir Topham Hat. Oh, boy, thanks! Now, as soon as I put your brakes back in, you'll be as good as new. Wait, why am I rolling? Am I moving or are the trees moving? What'd you say about my brakes? You took out my what? Holy cow, I can't stop! <sighs> Clearly, this is why I don't have real friends. We gotta have no brakes! Screamed Thomas, and indeed, he did not. All right, talk to me. Well, it seems Thomas is out of control and we can't stop him. Why can't I stop him? <laughs> this is Harold the Helicopter. How can I help you? Asked Harold. Harold, this is Control. I need you to shoot at Thomas and derail him from the track. Shoot at Thomas? Why, I couldn't. Thomas is my friend. Well, your friend is about to crash head first into a nearby town. Ugh, this is why I never work with talking machines. Well, it's like they say, never send a smiley helicopter to do an action star's work. Nobody says that. What's his cargo? Pardon? Thomas, his cargo. What's he carrying? Oh, <laughs> nothing too dangerous. Pillows, soft cheeses. A nuclear bomb. A nuclear bomb? And soft cheeses. Sheesh, were you even listening? All right, come on. I've got a train to catch. Oh, that's just terrible. I like this scene, McQueen. See, Mater? It's good to travel the world. I'm sorry about that. I'm unstoppable. It's a medical condition. I got a partner with him? I told you, I work alone. I like you. Look. Nobody knows the rails better than Percy. Fine. 
Just try to keep up, Junior. You're a nice man. I have propellers to feed! What's that crazy chopper doing? Doesn't he know if he hits that bomb, we're doomed? I like clouds. Yeah, ain't that the truth. You know, you and I aren't so different after all. <gasps> I see Thomas! Step on it! Thomas! We're coming! Hurry! <gasps> If you hadn't stopped me, I would have crushed the little town of Strawberry Shortcake! What the? Why am I... Oh. And nobody regretted any of their choices. The end. No! Any time now.